Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle today I'm going to be doing the latest travel news worldwide part two so let's jump right into it now according to breakingtravelnews.com these are the eight most fascinating brand new facts in regards to the travel industry I have so let's jump right into it now this information um, is based on breakingtravelnews.com so if you wanted to know more information then you can look on the breakingtravelnews.com of these stories and there's other Inf uh, information in regards to travel on there as well but first off is Fosu Ma Marriott Hotel Riverside opens in China and this year Marriott International has welcomed the, the opening of Fosu Marriott Riverside in the capital city of Funjian province province in China so the new hotel is located in the heart of the Donghu digital town so again I really hope uh, people flock back to China in that area when when the when it's safe to do so obviously it depends on the country of residence or the place of re residence where you are whether you're you are allowed to travel at, uh, to that province but hopefully um as soon as the whole of the pandemic 19 is over and um, if you're interested in going into uh, to that province in China then um, again um, I hope that um, you will st stay in the hotel because it does look absolutely fantastic and um, in a beautiful location so if you are interested in going to that area in China um, again check with your country or uh, province where you're living or state where you're living that you're able to travel if you are then um, and you're interested in going to that area then um, again it could be a fantastic um, holiday for you so um number two carnival cruise line cancels november sailing from florida unfortunately that's the latest cruise news now carnival cruise line has uh, notified its guests and travel agents that it is cancelling the remaining cruises for the six ships operating from port miami and port camberol for november this year november 2020 unfortunately it is a shame but again it has to be done in regards to the covid19 um situation and i really hope that next year carnival cruises uh, will be able to get up and running um as soon as possible and number three um spirit of adventure arrives in the uk yay ahead of february 2021 debut the cruise uh, that's the latest cruise news in the uk it's fantastic it looks amazing uh, ju uh, just like its sister cruise at spirit of discovery um both 
cruise lines uh, look amazing if you're thinking of going on a cruise um spirit of adventure um is a uh, debuting next year and it's going to set sail next year on february the 5th um 2021 and it's going to be sailing to the canary islands so wow that's amazing so uh, again if you go on that cruise and you'll probably be seeing all the canary islands at once um so if, if that's something that you are interested in then um or different parts of each island then uh, again a cruise could uh, could be for you um spirit of adventure will jo join her sister spirit of discovery in tilbury where she would lay up for the winter before welcoming her first guests for an in individual uh, cruise and again it's going to be february the 5th 2021 and um, it's going to set sail for the first time so i hope it goes as well as possible number four is alitalia airlines um inches closer to relaunch in italy the new airline is expected to have a fleet of more than a hundred um on the aircraft so um again it's uh, good news for alitalia um what they've done is basically started the first part um uh, because alitalia is an italian airline and um again i hope it goes as well as possible for alitalia and um the rest of the airlines and travel industry worldwide and number five a barbecue at Alcazar reopens at the Emirates Palace Hotel. That's again the latest hotel um, and food news. So I really hope um, the bar a barbecue goes as well as possible. And number six, Oman Air launches a new website for its passengers and also to woo their passengers so again it looks fantastic and i hope they gain more passengers or passengers in the future number seven singapore airlines launches its pop-up a380 dining experience it looks absolutely fantastic and again well done to oman air alitalia singapore airlines for doing these um events and launches and on e to lead club mediterranean commercial posh in southeast asia so i hope that goes as well as possible for the company Oni and Club Med commercial so and also the continent of Southeast Asia so thank you for watching if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe it's a red and white subscribe button and also click the notification bell and it'll get it give you indications well it'll basically tell you how uh, when i upload it's usually at least between three to six times a week so um again 
and um, please subscribe for more free content and thank you for watching please stay safe wherever you are in the world and thank you for watching and bye for now thank you bye